top drawer. When it's top drawer family, it's a whole nother thing for us. Dal Mackey is an incredible stylist. Um, very gentle, kind man, but more than anything, has a vision and his taste is extraordinary. His ability to adjust to a brief is the other one. But at the end of the day, it's the client who has to love what is presented to them. And for that, Dale, you are a magician. And most of our briefing is around music. You have to be at the forefront. You have to be ahead of a trend. And Dale just does it with so much grace. But I tell you what, do we laugh? And I mean, thick and thin. really laugh, right? Oh, we've gone through thick and thin. Yeah, we're together. Thick and thin, and at all hours of night, mm -hmm. and oh, change yeah. of a brief with probably three minutes before. And, and things not arriving on time. Things in different countries. Different countries when you need them. <laughs> yeah. But Dale, honestly, you are so loved in Thank our team. You. And most importantly, Guy Sebastian, who you dress um, around all the um, two episodes or two years of um, two The Voice. Years. But more importantly, That's around cool. Guy's music. Yeah. I think Guy just loves just being able to have so much fun with you yeah. um, and it is a lot of fun laugh, yeah right so Dale we are going to quiz you Mint on oh jeans. sorry yeah, you're usually more prepared Always a little just little a little, little bit there too he loves your flawless fun, flawless <laughs> all right we're good thanks for that Jen <laughs> thanks for that what's the first thing you did today I uh, took my contact lenses out. <laughs> contact. Um, sorry, yes. I'm oh, sorry, put, put them in. Put them in. <laughs> put them in or out? Put, put my contact lenses. Do you sleep with them or do you not sleep with them? I woke up, I put my lenses in, and then I opened up my doors and sat outside and um, looked at the garden and then just went through my phone and what emails I had. What's well, the first time you sent an email or a text? Um, an email was probably around quarter past eight. Oh, eight that's pretty good. Eight pretty good. Good. I try and, yeah, civilise. Yeah, about that. What city do you live in? Uh, Sydney. And where is your office located? Uh, this office is in East Sydney, in Darlinghurst, um, but I also work from home in Clovelly, and I guess we could call Guy's yeah. wardrobe and office yes, as right. well. Yeah, um, right. So yeah, all, all over the place, but mostly here for like the more admin sort of stuff um, and deliveries, and then home, I sort of put it all together. Do you, would you say you have more than six hours or less than six hours sleep? <sighs> Years ago, I'd be fine without six, but now more, oh, more, same. more, more. Tea yeah. or coffee? Um, tea. I don't drink coffee. Yes! <laughs> you don't want to see me on coffee. I go like <laughs> insane, yeah. insane. No, no, no. Me and caffeine is not a Still or sparkling? Ah, uh, still. Mm. Really? With a lemon or without a lemon? No lemon. Lime? No, just still chilled. What's your go-to work from home outfit? Uh, I'd wear shorts. Elasticated waist. Nice. Always. Coffee. Black shorts. Always black. T-shirt. No shoes. And um, what's your go-to work outfit? My work outfit. Mm. Um, yeah, you're black, probably black saying jeans, jeans boots, t-shirt. Well, because we're on set a lot, I like to just blend in yeah. a bit. I don't need to like stand out because yeah. I think it's not. It's not just. You what, know, what's what your favourite designer at the moment? Are they not for you, even for clients or guy or who you love at the moment? Well, the brand I was just showing you before, yep. it's a brand called Casablanca, which is um, out of Amazing. Paris, menswear. Yep. It's quite OTT, but it's it's quite resort-like. Love it. Um, but it's very pop star. It's very, like, celebrity yep. sort of driven, I think. Yeah, yeah. Um, Hollywood? Yeah, very Hollywood, like yep. old school Hollywood. Um, I love it. I don't think it's what I would wear, but yeah, I just really appreciate it. Yeah, it's colourful. Appreciate the style. I mean, I probably would on a high summer's day, but yeah. Casablanca. And this this brand also, which is called is Online Ceramics. They just do printed t-shirts and I just... That's fun. I like them. Yeah. Love it. Always discover. Yeah. 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 Great, great wardrobe tips. Uh, boots or sneakers? Boots. Always. Always boots. Even in school, I wore I love shoes. Love you. Did you? Boots, yeah. Doc Martens. Shoes. I always wear a shoe. What sort of aftershave? What brand do you? Any specific one you wear? I don't wear fragrance. I used to. I used to always have fragrance. Yep. Um, but I stopped wearing it a few years ago. What's the most important thing you can't live without? Uh, food. <laughs> food. What's your favourite cuisine? Oh, I think it's probably Italian. What's your favourite holiday destination? Let's imagine it's you can fly. Yes. Yeah, where um, would it be? I'm pretty easy. I like beach, I like sun. I'd love Asia, but I've never been to like Italy. I'd love to go to Italy. So right. if I could go tomorrow, yeah, let's, your... let's do Italy. Now what's the most used item at your desk or your workstation when you... Uh... Lint, of course. <laughs> <laughs> no, it'd be this, 
This or a stapler? Yeah. Because I'm always like... Stapler? Yeah. Because you can fix a problem without playing. Well, no, because I'm always like, Silas would know this, like, um, doing returns and sending back oh, packages and, oh, right, okay, you know, right. putting labels on things, like, always oh, a stapler. Oh, Receipts. Yeah, good one. And then, how would you keep your to-do list? Is it digital or is it paper? Digital mostly. Really? Yes. Oh, wow. And I have, because I'm um, I'm on the go, I might be yeah, sourcing sure. in the city or on the sh in, yeah. in the shops or whatever. I have my notes on my iPhone. iPhone. And then yeah. on my computer, I'll have a, for each job that I'm working on, I'll have a, just a word doc yeah. mm -hmm. with lists under categories yeah. of what I need to do. Got it. I find it easier to erase and highlight. Yeah. And then there's Excel spreadsheets for other things. And then what would be the three most used apps on your phone? Uh, my email, so Gmail, Uber. I don't drive. Oh, yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> uh, Uber and um, Instagram. Yep. Yeah, fair enough. Now, email, phone, Zoom, face-to-face -face kind of guy. How do you like to really work? I, I think it's, initially it's email. But I just feel like you can solve so much more from picking up a phone. In person is great, but it's a bit of a luxury yeah. with everyone's schedules. But I think if you're so feeling a bit, phone, jump on the phone. You can Without solve so same, much. Same if, I, I dwell on things and I read into things. So yes. you can easily misread things and not yes. understand. You know. And you get that extra layer of hearing a tone of voice. Totally. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, if you had a day off, or where, what would you do? Would you go anywhere? Uh, day off, I love like a massage, okay. um, beach, because I've moved to um, Coy Valley, so by the beach, I'll go for a swim. Right. I love a long lunch oh, with yeah, friends, yeah. food, chat. What's your biggest tip for staying on top of things? Uh, just be prepared and over prepare. Mm. Um, think the worst and just get it done. The worst. Really? Just, you think the worst? No, not think the worst, but just like worst case scenario. Worst case scenario like I anticipate oh, that and um, be prepared for that, and yeah. just and just if you see something that needs to be done, just get it done because once it's 100%. done, it's done. What would be your advice to a stylist coming out mm. now? Because I think there's so many people that want to do your job, yes, but don't there understand is. how hard it is. Yes, it's um, well, obviously you need to have like a certain taste level, but I think above and beyond that, you need to work hard, you need yeah. to be personable, and you need to be malleable. Yeah. You need to take on everybody's point of view. Mm and still have your own, maintain yeah. your own, but it's it's part of a bigger picture. Yeah. So there's that side of it. And just work hard, be grateful. Um, Do you ever regret being a stylist? No, never. Do you still find that passion? Like yes, when you definitely. see something yeah. that stimulates you, what's yeah. that response for you? I can, it's weird to explain, but like I can see, I might see something, but then I can see it being used further down the track. Or I can right. see its moment or I can, I don't know, I just, it just, Inspires me. Yeah. What's your best way to decompress after a busy day? Sometimes I actually like to be with people yeah, um, and sort of chat it through and wind down that way. Mm. Um, other times, hot shower, yeah. comfy clothes, shakti mat. Have you had a shakti before? No, shakti. It's What's like that? a shakti mat. It's um, it's like an it's an Indian um, invention. It's basically a mat and it has like spikes on it, oh. sort of like an old school masseur yeah. sandal. So you lay on it and in it um it's sharp oh, point it's plastic. Oh my gosh, yeah. does it hurt like I can't Yeah, it function. stings. It's like um plastic spikes that push into your pressure zones and release like all And your, does it actually help? Yes. Um, it's a scary it, looking it, thing, but like you lay on it and it's horrifying. it's it's high pain, but you get oh, about is that pre or post of vodka? Oh seriously? No, it's it's pre. I wouldn't lay on it post vodka because I've I actually have fallen asleep on one before. Day are life lessons to live by. It's not all about you. Good one. When you need to think about other people, and um, like, like I was saying about how to be a stylist, you have to take in other people's um, mm -hmm. opinion. This shall pass, this too shall pass. I think that's really good. Um, Especially because you, you've got a really stressful job. Like, yeah. it's moments when I'm like, oh, it's yeah. Really and at times I might ring you and I'm like, I haven't got that yeah. pair of pants hasn't like, arrived. And you're like, from it, yeah. It's all solutions, but in out. my mind, I, you know, my. Oh, that that's escalate that because control. that's what I need to live, deliver. So little things like that and little personal anxiety things that I might yeah. suffer, like in that moment, you just got to remember. It's going to pass. It's going to pass. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And we've got you back. Yeah, yes. as a team. Um, do you work with music on by chance? I sometimes do, not always. For example, we're working on Guy's video. Yes. I'll play that song yes. and I'll play it to death yeah. while I'm researching because yes, it helps cool. me. I tend to play like piano-y sort of music, not... Might be more classical? Yeah, yeah. classical, nothing. Um, I like things very... Calm. Calm, yep. yeah. So good.
What do you love the most about your job? I love working with other creatives and other um, people that um, are inspirational. I love the end result. I love the process, but I also just love seeing the end result. Yeah, the dream and then how it aligns with the other people. Yeah, just seeing that end, the end product, whether it be in a music video or red carpet or yeah. TV. Yeah. Great. Dale, you are one of the most extraordinarily kind gentlemen. I think you're so talented. Um, and I know that we've got so much more to achieve together. But thank you so much thank for being with us. Thank you. Thanks, Jen. Thanks, love. Love you. Yay. Thank you. That was sweet. <laughs>